guys, I'm Biname and welcome to Sweet Yesterday. This game looks adorable! Also, I apologize if you hear any uh, sounds in the background. There's construction going on nearby. So yeah, if you hear any like hammers or anything, I apologize for that. Let's begin! Imaginary friends are truly a fascinating concept. Developing a personal relationship with someone that doesn't exist in reality. Oh, look at it. Oh, this is adorable. How do our minds even come up with something like that? This type of behavior has been considered hallucinatory or even psychotic. However, it is a normal and common phenomenon for children to have. The growing mind of a child is an incredible and creative thing. They have the ability to conjure up an entire personality for a being that doesn't exist. But how do they come up with vivid characters in the first place? The answer is... They come from within us. The traits of our imaginary friends stem from our personalities in real life. Of course they do. It's only natural after all. In an ideal world where we can create our perfect friends, wouldn't we want them to be similar to us? All of our personality traits got get reflected onto the imaginary friends that we create. If you are particularly extroverted, then it is likely that your imaginary friends will be extroverted too. If you enjoy singing and dancing, then it is likely that your imaginary friends will share the same hobbies too. But, how do we know who we truly are? Some traits that we don't know that we have can manifest in unexpected ways. Because nobody is perfect. Nobody's personality is flawless. Everybody has good and bad traits. It's just a matter of... Of what? Of what? Laletta. Laletta, can you hear me? Are you listening? No, what? A voice. Laletta. Oh my god, this is adorable! Laletta. Oh good, you seem to be paying attention now. Oh. I'm going to continue asking you the questions. When did it first start? Huh? When did what first start? Were you not listening after all? It's fine, I'll repeat myself. When did your selfish and insincere behavior start? <laughs> Dang! What are you talking about? You're still not willing to talk about it. I guess so. Let me move on. Laletta, when did your vain and narcissist... <laughs> Dang! This, this therapist is brutal! I, I don't know what you're talking about. Laletta, the only way this will help you is if you're honest with me. Do you not realize that I'm on your side? I'm sorry. I'm just really confused. Okay. Just do your best to answer me. L Laletta, you've always loved cooking, right? Uh, I can answer this question. I've loved being in the kitchen for as long as I can remember. <laughs> I love cooking. 
I love seeing people smile when they eat my food. Hmm. What is it that you like about cooking? Aside from people eating your food. What is it about cooking itself that you actually enjoy? Well... I like the act of cooking itself. Playing with the food in my hands is a lot of fun. Hmm, I see. Now, for my final question. Loletta, how long has it been since... S since what? Since what, game? What is this? Why is she sleeping on the floor? This floor is cold and hard. Floors kind of tend to be like that, Loletta. Oh my god, look at the bears. Look at the bears! This place is... I want to look at the bears! Look at the bears! A teddy bear made of rich, smooth chocolate. Why is the bear made of that chocolate? A telephone. Hello? Oh. Oh, you did not like that voice. Uh, save. A chocolate door. Go inside! We have nothing else to do in this room. Oh my god! Oh, why is this game so cute? Oh, I love it! Wow, what a cute place! Everything seems so... Everything seems to be made out of chocolate. Oh my god, look at it! Oh, I love it! Oh, oh I'm crying from the cuteness! I'm not taking anything. I'm not taking anything. Oh my god. What's this? What is this? Welcome back, Loletta. What? What's this? A chocolate sculpture is blocking the passageway. Oh, oh look, a little chest, a little chesty. A sparkling locked chest. Uh, I don't, I don't know the password. You know, I'm gonna take the samples. Take them. Oh my god. Everything is so cute! Oh my god! Oh, I love this game so much! <laughs> Can I talk? I'm hungry. Oh, oh! Give them the... Give them the stuff. Uh... Items. Samples. Here you go. And I'm guessing you guys are thirsty? Yep. Here you go. Oh! Oh! Something unlocked. The passageway is unlocked. Oh my god, everything is so cute! Talk to the ribbon! Aren't these roses so pretty? Is there a specific rose I have to look at? Oh, this one's shiny. This one is shiny. There's a number drawn on one of the petals. Three. Oh, there's a sign underneath. Oh, so yellow three, blue six. Do these, do the numbers save? Oh, they do save. They do save. Oh, thank God. I'm terrible with remembering numbers. Okay, six. No. Oh, there's something inside. Oh, God dang it. Oh, a small gem fell out of the chocolate. I want it. I want the gem. Oh, sweet. Eight. Okay. Eight. The chest opened. There's a drawing inside the chest. My friends. There's something else in the chest. Oh, a lighter. Take the lighter. Arson! Yes! Arson! Light it on fire! <laughs> light it! Light it! 
<laughs> the lighter it of oil. Dang it, no more arson. Oh my god, everything is adorable. What a beautiful young lady you've become. <laughs> oh, stop it, you. What are these? Why are they kind of glowing a bit? Adorably wrapped presents. Oh, there's like three passageways. Let's... What's down here? Oh, this one is locked. And what's in the mail door? Okay! Things like to be locked. What do you have to say, Ribbon? That teddy bear won't stop crying. Can't he at least cry quieter? <laughs> Dang! What's wrong? I... I got into a fight with my friend. I'm so sad, I don't know what to do. I wish I could cheer up somehow. Aww. Oh. A sign. Read it. Welcome to the chalk. Welcome to the chocolatery. Here we have four kinds of chocolate. Loved by everyone, milk chocolate is a safe bet for anyone to like. A more sophisticated taste, dark chocolate. Oh, I love dark chocolate. Is suited for a mature palate. Sweet and healing white chocolate is perfect for comforting people. I also love white chocolate. I've never had pink chocolate though. Unique and fun, pink chocolate is a great fit for you. Want to try it if you want to try something new. Let's get him some white chocolate. Take it. Here you go. Here's some chocolate. Oh, white chocolate. White chocolate always helps me calm down. This is perfect. Please take this as a thank you. Heart seat added to inventory. Thank you. That is... I love running into walls. Uh, X. Let me place the seat. <laughs> Here we go. The tables are all set. An unlocking noise can be heard. Uh, I don't... This painting does not make me feel comfortable. My dear. It talked! Would you do me a favor? I don't know. Well, what do I get out of it? Ah, uh, nothing, I'm afraid. Sorry to have bothered you, my dear. Fine, I'll do it. Gee, stop asking me already! What? Anyways, the other painting's over there. Would you help me show her my love? I want to go over there and show her myself, but I'm too far away. Please, help my feelings reach her. Aw, that's so sweet. Of course. I'll do my best, Mr. Painting. Thank you, my dear. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Everything is so cute. Uh, read the book. There's nothing special about me. I gave up as an ordinary child. I didn't suffer from hardships or dilemmas. I had a normal childhood. I was just like everyone else. So, you see, when I created my imaginary friends, it wasn't because I was lonely. People liked me. I had friends. I didn't do it as a way to escape. I did it because I was creative. There's no special reason behind it, and that's what I keep telling him. But he keeps trying to psychoanalyze me and find some deeper meaning behind it. Well, guess what? I'm sorry, but there is no deeper meaning. I was a child. I had nothing else to do but be creative. It was so much fun to come up with my own friends. After all, I could decide every last detail about them. How they acted, what they liked, everything. So I made them all just like me. As I grew as a person, they grew with me. And continue to be my perfect reflections. 
They were the best friends that I ever had. I didn't get to finish that! Take the roses. What's this? A trash can? Wasn't there a thing about that? Empty you like my soul? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, here's a rose. Here you go, miss. This is for you. Oh, a white rose. How lovely. Thank you. <laughs> oh, don't thank me. It's from that painting over there. He wanted me to help him express his feelings for you. He loves you very much. His feelings for me? I had no idea he felt that this way. Please tell him that I love him too. To show my gratitude for helping us out, you can have this. Thank you once again. Whoa, what is it? I got a knife! Oh my god, it's a... Why is the knife adorable? Why is everything adorable? <laughs> Mr. Painting, I have news for you. Miss Painting says that she loves you too. Isn't that great? Oh, really? I'm so glad. Thank you, my dear. Okay, off I go. And I can go in here now. Nope. No, I can't. Oh. Oh, what's in here? What? Oh, I don't like this. Hello. The teddy bear is staring straight ahead at the wall. Do I... No? Okay. Uh... Oh. 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 A letter. I wonder what I'll be like in ten years' time. I hope I stay the same. I like myself the way I am. Or maybe I might become even better than I am now. Who knows? One thing is for sure, though. I hope I only become a better person. I won't ever want to lose myself. I wouldn't ever want to lose myself. Oh, the lighting changed. Hello? Uh. <laughs> oh! Oh! What happened in this room? It looks like someone was here! <gasps> the teddy bear is all bloody! The teddy bear is stepping his <laughs> what happened? It was so cute a moment ago. Oh, thank God it's back to cute. Hold on. Use the knife. Use the knife. Cut the stop it. Oh. Oh, there's a key. Oh. She's finally back. Oh my god, it's adorable! Hello? Hi! Oh my god. What? Oh, mirror, mirror. Why is it, why is it glowing? An enchanting mirror. Oh! You see a familiar face staring back at you. Hello? Is 
sweeter yesterday. Oh! Oh, Lala, what? Girl? Girl, what's in your closet? Oh, I get to add something to a menu. Grilled cheese. <laughs> Grilled cheese, huh? <laughs> I'll think about adding it to the menu. I hope the customers will like it. It's grilled cheese. Everyone will like it. It's about time I go to work, isn't it? You're not, you're not going to get changed? My name is Loletta. I am 22 years old. Although I'm still young, I managed to open my own restaurant by myself. My restaurant is called Dreamy Kitchen, and it's my pride and joy. I love cooking. I love being able to pursue my passion every day when I head into work. The best feeling is seeing people smile when they eat my food. My job brings me happiness. I have very few problems, and my life is amazing. That's right. My life is amazing, of course. There's nothing sweeter than being in the moment today. Uh, go in the kitchen. Oh, oh, what's this? What's this? Do you need to ask me something? Oh? What do you think of Laletta? I love her, of course. Lala is my best f is the best friend I've ever had. I've known her for a long time now. But even as the years pass, we never grow apart. Time makes our bond stronger. I love her. I really... I really do. Sorry. It's such a straightforward and simple question, yet here I am getting emotional. She just means so much to me. That's all. She's always been so kind to me. That's one of her best traits. She's sweet and friendly to everyone she meets. That's why people love her so much. And, during times where I needed kindness, she was there for me. So, of course I love her. Well, guys, that was the demo of Sweeter Yesterday. I hope you enjoyed, and... I, I mean, I really did enjoy this. It was a... It was adorable! And I'm honestly looking forward to when the full game gets released. Anyway, guys, that's gonna be it for today. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.